My love, what are you going to? It's your bag? I am no longer interested in this relationship. It seems like as if you are playing me. Why? You have seen me finish. Five good years in this relationship and seven times abortion. Yet, we are not married. You continue to postpone things. No, there is no need. I'm sorry. Yes, my love. I thought we've treated this issue before. I don't want to have baby out of wedlock. Please, my boo boo. I love you so much. You know that. Mm -hmm. Please, my love. It will never repeat itself again. I promise you. Mm -hmm. Everything is going to be fine very soon. Just soon, my dear. I promise. It will you, not dear. happen again, no. No, no more abortion. Not at all. Not at all. I promise me next year we're going to do our wedding. Big one for that matter. I'm going to. Ah! <laughs> I love you so much. I love you too. Don't worry. I'm going to, I'm going to make big fourth welding for both of us. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, you look beautiful. Thank you. Wow. Oh, thanks to you. Yeah. <laughs> How is everything, love? I'm good. I'm good. You I'm called good. me. Hope everything's fine. Yeah, you know, I told you I've not been feeling fine. All this while. And and I went to the doctor, and the result says I'm pregnant. <laughs> Seriously? Yeah. Carry my baby? I'm telling you. I know it's gonna be a boy. No, 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 no. It's a girl. It's a boy. It's a girl. Wow! <laughs> I'm so happy. Me too. So, Fred, you're welcome. It's been a while. What can I offer you now? Nothing for now, thank you. Aww. I just came here to check on you. Oh, that's so sweet of you. Since it's already about time you give birth. Yeah. Hmm. Nine months, right? It's seven months now. In oh, two seven months. months. In two months time, you'll be an aunt. I'm so excited. <laughs> But he said he never loved her. That is me he loves. And he said he's gonna do away with her very soon. But you don't visit regularly, so dear friend, visiting is not enough. You know that. In these times he's supposed to be by your side at least I don't know, half of the time. Hmm. Visiting is really not enough. Yeah, Have you, you know, tried talking to him about this? Yes. We talk um it was not about that's about um three months ago yes you know girlfriend i don't want to you know keep disturbing you so you won't feel like i'm you know adding to something else or planning something else i just wanted to do it in this whole time to go talk to him again because it's very important mm. he cannot keep promising you and not fulfilling the promise you're right i will do exactly as you just said i will go tomorrow morning and see him that is good make sure you do it okay oh thank you so much girlfriend i don't know what i would have done without you no problem you're I'm so you. sweet <laughs> You know, this time around, I need you around. Oh, how is my baby doing? It's fine. I really appreciate your patience. This girl is really stubborn. Don't worry yourself. I might even tell her today. You just go home. Huh? I'll come and meet you. Huh? I don't want to wait any longer because I'm tired of waiting. I need you by my side. I understand you, my love. I understand you. Please, you just go home. You don't have to stress yourself. Okay. Huh? Take care. Huh? Mm. I'll see you later in the day, eh? Bye-bye. Why is this girl stuck on me? Five years relationship. Seven times abortion. 
Is it not obvious that I'm not going to marry her? You know that she is very, very stupid. The handwriting is written, boldly written on the wall. Huh. My Sophia. I love Sophia so much. I have to be with Sophia. I believe when she comes back today, I have to tell her that the game is over, that the relationship is over between both of us. I can't be it any longer. Baby! <laughs> Babe! What is it? Why are you looking like that? Are you okay? I'm okay. I got good news for you, baby. Come here! <laughs> I got good news. What news do you have for me? I told you I'll be going to the doctor, didn't I? Uh-huh, so? Yes, now guess. Guess what? Guess now. Nah. Talk to me. You know I'm not going to guess him. Talk to me. I'm watching an interesting How movie. This your face is not analyzing, you know? I hope so nobody offends you. Anyway, I know you're your kind of person, let me tell you. I'm pregnant. <laughs> pregnant again? How come? I thought you were using peas. Baby, don't tell me you are serious right now. Huh. Five years of courtship, seven times abortion, now the eighth time. We literally sleep together. You 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 know what we do every night. So you are telling me what now, please? Look at you. Five years of courtship, seven times abortion. And you are telling me again that you are pregnant for me. How come you are so stupid that you cannot see the handwriting boldly written on the wall that I don't want this relationship? I have not even engaged you. <laughs> I love you just say you are joking. You are joking, right? Joking? Is there anything you have been having in mind to tell me? Because the last time I checked, you've been telling me to be patient. You've been telling me that you didn't want a child at all. Is your name patient? If I tell if I tell you to be patient, is your name patient? Okay, so are you trying to tell me that I'm stupid? Hold on, I have to tell you now. I have a girlfriend outside that is pregnant for me. And very soon, she's going to give birth. All I'm trying to tell you now is the relationship is over. I'm no longer interested, I cannot pretend. You are joking, baby. Joking? You are joking, please. Okay, I've told you my mind. So you are the, telling me... The relationship is over. You've been on my neck. I am no longer interested in this relationship. After five years of courtship, seven times abortion, remember all the time you used to beg me. How many times I wanted to walk away from this relationship. You told me to be patient. And now you came up with this. Another woman is pregnant of... Like... So you see me finish. You used me. You dumped me right now. Ah, now only God, now he will judge you. Only God will judge you. Don't worry, I take my things and I will live your life. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you learned a lesson. My advice goes to the ladies. My ladies, try to acknowledge the red flags men shown to us in every relationship sometimes the handwriting is boldly written on the wall so when a man is not interested to marry you please don't force it we the ladies will always suffer it at the end thank you once more please don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel press that notification bell and share with your friends until we see again in the next video. Thank you. Bye.